Distraction is proud to be sponsored by Omega Bright, the premier natural advanced omega-3 formula for mind, heart, and joint health. And Talkspace, the online therapy company that believes that therapy should be affordable, confidential, and convenient. For a special offer, visit Talkspace.com slash distraction. Hello, this is Dr. Ned Hallowell for Distraction. Today we have for you a mini distraction popular among our listeners because everyone's in such a hurry these days. It's nice to take a short break for a mini version of our usually longer podcast. The subject today is an unusual one. I want to take you into a kind of a fantasy, if you will, about what to do if you happen to have an evening by yourself. The major theme of our podcast is connection, but this is really an evening where you can connect with yourself. If you're like me, these evenings occur very, very rarely, but when no one is home, and in in our house we have uh, relatives who live with us and other people who come and stay and, and, uh, of course, my wife, um, so it's unusual that the house is empty except for me. Uh, and our dog. Uh, But it does happen. And when it does happen, it's really very special. And so I want to invite you to fantasize along with me. What might you do on an evening alone? And I'll, I'll guide you through the fantasy, if you will, by telling you what I did on a recent evening that I had to myself. I came home looking forward to knowing that uh, no one was going to be there and I would have time by myself. I stopped at a a little store near where we live and got a half pound of hamburger uh, because I love to make burgers and um, went home and made myself two hamburgers that I cooked in a skillet and put on hamburger roll with raw onion and got some potato chips, all things that my wife would not want to eat with me, and cooked up some lima beans, which she doesn't like and I love. So I had, first of all, my little supper all to myself of burgers with sliced onion on them and cheese and mustard, potato chips and lima beans, and I sat at the kitchen table poured myself a glass of red wine, and read the newspaper. I read The Globe as much as I wanted to, and The Times as much as I wanted to, and The Wall Street Journal as much as I wanted to, little bits of each of those three, while sitting at the kitchen table. I then fed our dog, much to his incredible delight. We have a Jack Russell named Ziggy. Uh, He ate his meal and went outside to do his business outside, came back in, And then I went into the living room and uh, turned on the lights, but not very bright, and just sat down on the couch and kind of looked off into the distance. It was dark outside, and I just daydreamed. I just sat there daydreaming, thinking about whatever, nothing earth-shattering, but just I wasn't meditating, but I was just quietly daydreaming. Someone else might have gone and taken a bath, uh, but I don't take baths. I just take showers. So a bath was not an option. But just sitting on the couch without any interruption, without my cell phone, uh, without music, without anything, just sitting there by myself, staring off into the distance, thinking about whatever. I, I don't remember what I thought about, but I remember just enjoying the solitude and the uh the chance to not have to think about anything (laughs) and uh, to enjoy the peace and quiet. And sure enough, Ziggy got up on the couch with me after he'd finished from outside. And I would sit there stroking Ziggy uh, as he would nuzzle into my lap and just be by myself. Well, I did that probably for, I don't know, half an hour. And then Ziggy and I went upstairs 
And um, uh, I turned on the TV. I'm a big fan of uh, TV. Uh, I know that sounds very unsophisticated, but I love TV. I can watch pretty much anything. And I don't remember what I watched, but it was probably something like uh, Law and Order or some some uh, detective show of some sort or another. Uh, and of course, I got into my nightshirt. I wear a nightshirt. I don't wear pajamas. I wear a nightshirt. My kids call it my dress. And I crawled onto the covers and turned on the TV. And Ziggy came right up with me and climbed up onto the bed. And so now we've recreated the scene, only I'm under the covers and Ziggy is nuzzling up next to me, and we're watching TV. And I watched TV until I started to feel tired, and turned off the TV, turned off the light, and lay in bed doing the same thing I'd done sitting on the couch. Takes me a while to fall asleep usually. And with Ziggy next to me, I just let myself quietly drift off into dreamland. And that was my evening. My wife had been out at a dinner group, so I knew she'd be late. Uh, and so I was asleep when she got home. She asked me the next day, what did you do uh, last night? And I said, well, nothing. <laughs> but I loved doing it. <laughs> and so I thought I'd share with you my evening of doing nothing and commend it to you as a very special kind of evening by yourself where you connect with yourself and, and uh, with all that comes into your mind when you're alone. If you happen to have a dog, so much the better. And you sort of let yourself feel what it is to be alive. It wasn't ecstasy by any means. I'm sure I felt sad for some portion of that time because there's a lot of sadness in life. But I didn't fight it, you know. I just felt the flow of feelings, thoughts, images, and let myself uh, have them. Uh, something that I rarely do, and I dare say most of us rarely do. Just enjoy being alone on your own terms, living the life that you have. Try it sometime. Well, this is Dr. Ned Hallowell with our mini distraction. Remember to check out our sponsors, Omega Bright, the 100% natural and advanced omega-3 formula. To order, go to Omega Bright, that's O-M-E-G-A-B-R-I-T-E dot com, or call 1-800-383-2030. That's 1-800-383-2030. 2030. And Talkspace, the online therapy company that believes that therapy should be affordable, confidential, and convenient. Join over 500,000 people who have used Talkspace for online therapy with their licensed personal therapist. For a special offer, visit Talkspace.com slash distraction. That's Talkspace.com forward slash distraction. You can also go to our website, distractionpodcast.com, and click on the Omega Bright and Talkspace logos. Distraction is produced by Collisions, the podcast division of CRN International. Collisions, podcasts for curious people. Our music was created by Mark Berman. Our audio engineer is Scott Person. And our producer is Sarah Gurton. 